What is happening? And welcome to another episode of Making Games. And today, today is a fateful day. Well, actually, no, it's not today. It's, it's not tomorrow. It's the next day. Today's Tuesday. But uh, as you'll see in the background, uh, that is pretty much half of my life all packed up on one, one table. And, um, you know, it does bring a tear to the eye thinking about moving out. But the time's come, guys. The time's come. I'm renting the place out, you guys know. And the tenant moves in on Monday. Today is Tuesday. Tomorrow, my flatmate moves out, so all his shit will be out. Um, I'm working tomorrow, and then Thursday is the day that I'm moving all my stuff out. My sister's coming to help me. And then Friday, I'm getting a cleaner to come in. Saturday, I'm getting <laughs> some uh, security screens installed for the new tenant to bring it up to standard for their, their liking. And then Sunday, the keys get handed over, and Monday... The tenant moves in and I effectively start getting paid rental income on this property also. So it's a fateful day, it really is. But uh, like I said, this is, <laughs> this is everything, man. Except for some of my clothes, so... Fucking hell. Anyways. I'm just going to continue this vlog. My camera's all packed away. It's over there. My computer's packed away, so I'm going to use my cell phone for this. Um, I think I'll pick up the camera tomorrow, on Wednesday and tell you guys how things are tracking. So this is probably going to be like a four or five day vlog. Um, it's very stressful times, but you know, I'm just going to go with the flow. Like I said, everything's organized day by day. So fingers crossed, it all goes to plan. I'll see you guys soon. Oh, sup? What is going on, guys? Holy shit, it seems... Fuck it. It actually sounds like that that echoey sound that I remember the first time I walked into this house. Because there's fuck all in it, man. This is... This is not easy, man. I, 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 I didn't really want to continue this vlog. Um, I didn't want to talk about leaving this place because... You know, at the end of the day, it's, it's fucking... It's... It's quite upsetting, man. It's emotional. I'm not gonna cry. But, uh, you know, this was... This was the first place I... I lived in by myself and set up, you know, with furniture, the furniture I, I always wanted and things like that, let alone the first house I, I bought as well. So, you know, there's a lot of emotional attachment here, although at the end of the day, I did buy it as an investment property, so I have to keep telling myself that, um, you know, emotions were never meant to get involved. But I've lived here for 18 months, man. I've had two different flatmates. Um, I've had a shitload of, you know, experiences here new experiences, getting into the real estate world. This, this series, this Making Gains series, is, has been going for a year of that. So I started this series in August last year. I moved into this house in December the year before. So the date today is July the 13th, and I moved in here on December the 19th, 2015. So it's probably been about 19 months I've lived here, guys. And it's a sad, sad day. It's a fucking sad day. I'd be lying if I said it wasn't. Honestly, man. Just looking around, knowing that I'm literally like... Well, today's Thursday. My flatmate... Fuck, I haven't seen that room yet. I was going to say, my, I, hope, I hope my flatmate has uh, got everything out, which he has. Um, I'm pretty much done. You know, all my cupboards are fucking... Beer. There's a few clothes for like tomorrow, and that's it. And um, that's pretty much it, man. Honestly, uh, the lady's coming in tomorrow, Friday. She's coming in at eight in the morning. I have taken the day off work tomorrow, so it's going to be me and her trying to clean this place. Um, I don't. I, I'm going to tell her straight up first thing in the morning. I don't want to spend over five hundred bucks on this fucking clean, which means you've got ten hours to do your best. Start in there, in the bathroom. So, that's it guys. Tonight, I'm going to go to the gym. I'm going to smash a workout, which is going to put me in a great mood. I've got no fridge here, I've got no freezer, I've got nothing, so... I don't know what I'm going to do for food, but um, I'll get something. And basically, sleep my last night, 
in my bed, my fucking king size bed that I'm giving away. I'm not giving away, but I'm renting. And um, that is it, guys. So I'll talk to you tomorrow once I've left for good. Because tomorrow, you know, lunchtime will be the, the time that I finish cleaning and I'll leave that lady to do the rest. And I say sayonara, give her the keys and say give them to the real estate agent when you're done. And that's it. That's going to be so weird, man. All right, guys, what is going on? We're back. It's uh, it's just past one in the morning, and I am fucked. But uh, the house is pretty much, it's all clear, man. Everything I own is in my car right now. And, you know, I've had to do that a few times before. Let me see if I can show you. The only clear space is the driver's seat. So that's full of clothes. I don't even want to open the door because it's all going to come fucking flying out. But the whole car is packed full. But uh, we've got a little bit of rubbish there. We've got some shit that I don't need. It's going in the bin. Last load of washing on the, on the line. And that, my friends, was pretty much all she fucking wrote for this place anyway. So this was the first. The second I bought on the Gold Coast. The third is in the works, but we're certainly not there yet. But, uh, you know, I am just, I'm, I'm exhausted. I'm relieved. I'm still stressed because the job's not done. But I'm going to go to sleep soon and get up at about 7 o'clock, start cleaning myself, and then this lady's going to come around at 8.30 and start helping me at $50 an hour. So, yeah. End of an era, that's for sure. I am quite upset. I don't want to leave. <laughs> really don't. Well, good morning, guys. Today is Friday, the fateful day. And this lady's about to come around. It's about eight in the morning. I got like four hours sleep. So, definitely feeling a little bit on the tired side this morning, but um, how about this lighting? I quite like it. Anyway, this is probably the last time I'm ever going to walk out here. If it wasn't sad yesterday, it's definitely sad now. Oh well. Anyways. That's it guys, I'm gonna I'm gonna call it a day here man. This lady's nearly here, I've gotta put some more rubbish in the in the bin over there, and then that's it, so table's clear. Everything's gone. See you guys tomorrow.